See, a lot of dudes be getting tight when they see me uploading repeats and re-uploading episodes. You feel what I'm saying? But you know what that is? That's non-subscriber problems. Because when you're subscribed to the actual channel, you know what I mean? You go on the channel and you see everything is neat and clean, bro. I got a whole playlist of just new and recent episodes. Then I got to play this 50,000 and better views then it's the all murder playlist the all saquon playlist the l famous playlist the wise playlist you feel me then i'm working on this all last playlist you know it's a million stories i gotta add all shannon briggs when chasing your eggplant goes wrong brooklyn legacy playlist you heard and the list goes on new york state prison rikers island legends Everything is neat and clean and in order. You heard? If you don't want to see nothing but the newest episodes, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you subscribe to that playlist. Recent and new episodes only. But what do you mean? What do you mean niggas was trying to throw bombs in niggas' cribs, son? Son, niggas threw a bomb and a nigga tried to throw and it's shit. It, 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 it bounced off the wall and rolled under somebody's car and boom yo hold and on boom. nah this is for real this is real shit so hold on so you saying that your projects and and, and and the garvey was beefing so crazy that it got to a point where niggas was trying to throw bombs in niggas in niggas windows well what i would say is this right because like I said, you know what I mean? Like, you know, it wasn't really, it wasn't my beef, but it was, you know, I, I, you know, I, I got a lot of brothers that these niggas is crazy. So anyway, all I know is that son got killed. And next thing you know, we got, we on yo, niggas is putting arms on you, right? Yo, here, hold this. And, and it's a Mac. And, and now niggas like, yo, hold this. And it's a tech. And now, and we following up. Where you going? What's up? What Now we crossing Rockaway. And we going in the garden. I didn't know what the situation was. But what I would say is that niggas threw, try to throw the bomb in the window. I don't know. But what type? What type of bomb? How that shit look? How that bomb look? No, it was it was official bombs. You know what I mean? Like you know, you know, cause 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 some was coming from the the army and all that. You said y'all had an army connect? Yeah, he was coming from the army and, and loading us up with all type of hammers and all type of bombs and it was crazy. We had all type of shit. Like you could look like 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 niggas could literally put shit in a crate and be like, yo, what you want? Pick one. Like pick one. Yo, we used to hold hammers in the fucking like the exit. I mean, pawn up, not the exit, but the the, the hole, the the the, the 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 what do you call it? The, the elevator and block the elevator. It's only one elevator moving. It had hammers in there? It's a whole fucking thing of guns and bombs and 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 just block the elevator. That's a fact. That's a fact. It's a whole elevator, bro. A whole elevator. You know the crate? Like you know you sit on the crate? Yeah. It's a whole <clears throat> bunch of fucking guns and bombs and all type like and then you know what I mean when that shit happened you know what I mean like you know niggas was upset and niggas threw like niggas trying to throw that shit in the window word word son niggas trying to throw the shit in the window and the shit bounced off the wall and, and hit the car boom fuck yo what the fuck <laughs> It's a fact, bro. And then we just, you know what I mean? Like, you know, we, we out. You know what I mean? Like, nah, we was on some, this shit was different. You know what I'm saying? Like, and then them niggas wasn't moving around like that either. You know what I mean? Boys and all that. You know what I mean? Like, they was around, but they wasn't around. We was just, 
do what the fuck we want to do. You know what I mean? At that time. You know what I mean? And if they was around, we might squeeze at them too. Niggas was squeezing at them niggas too, son. I know we get it fucked up. Niggas, niggas get in the hole and be like, yo, no, 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 no. Six, seven joints go up, them niggas going back downstairs. You know what I mean? We run to the top floor. <laughs> wow, son. Shit was different, son. You know what I mean? Like, no. Shit was different, man. Wow. Yeah, it's just crazy, man, because niggas don't be knowing, like, it, it, niggas don't be knowing, like, um, niggas be going, niggas be in urban warfare at a very young age out there, man. And, that, and, and that's the thing, you know what I mean? Like, it was what it was, you know what I mean? And that excitement, you know what I mean, at that time, you know what I mean? Like, you know, it, it, was, it was that excitement, you know, it, it, it was what it was. It was going on. If you if you chasing me in the building, I, I might throw two shots into the air, boom, boom, and scare you, and then run into another, you know, apartment. I might do that. I'm sorry, but it, you know, it, it, you know, it was, but it was. You know what I mean, like you know, because that was that time. You know what I mean, like. Cause you know, like now it's like, oh, they gonna hunt a nigga down and all that. You know what I mean? Like, you know, it'd be a lot of shit, man. It'd be a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, niggas is just, you know what I mean? Niggas is just saying, you know what I mean? Exactly what go on in these fucking streets, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, niggas be thinking this shit is, nah, it ain't everything. It ain't everything. Yo, so I told dudes, um, I'm gonna do three three little shows. You feel me? Rikers Island joint, the up north state prison joint, and I'm gonna do a Brownsville joint. You know what I mean, growing up in Brownsville joint, you heard? <laughs> a lot of these stories, a lot of these stories come from out of my audio book. Like I got an audio book called Kids with Guns. You understand what I'm saying? It's a tragic tale about Brownsville, Brooklyn bunch of kids running around with machine guns and shit that should have had other opportunities instead of truckloads of guns and drugs in the late 80s crack era in Brownsville, Brooklyn. That's what my audio book is about, which I'm trying to get to pop to a movie. You feel what I'm saying? Because when I sit down and tell this story of my life to somebody, it's gonna have to hit the big screen. You understand what I'm saying? Cause it's a message and it's a message about gun control. It's a message about a lot of stuff. You understand what I'm saying? Drugs, poverty, and the whole shebang. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know what I mean? We're gonna get into other, we're gonna get into some other details later. This one time in Brownsville, this is the time when niggas jump me. If you grow up in Brownsville, man, you, you, you're gonna get jumped a few times. You feel what I'm saying? Dude like me, I got jumped a thousand times in Brownsville and all over the place. You feel what I'm saying? So this one time it was Easter Sunday. This had to be like 89 or 90. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm going to 275 Junior High School in Rockaway and Hegeman in Brownsville, right before you hit Canarsie. It's like on the borderline of Brownsville and Canarsie. So I'm gonna start going to that school. School was dumb, wow. I'm gonna tell some stories about that school too. Niggas was 12 years old having shootouts, real talk. In my junior high school, niggas was having shootouts. Like, I mean, another junior high school, Marcus, that's the most popular junior high school in Brownsville. They always had beef for 275. I ain't know that. I would've just went to Marcus. Instead, I went to 275 and I got caught up in that bullshit. You feel what I'm saying? But it was wars in my junior high school where niggas was having shootouts 12, at 12 years old, 12 years old, 13 years old. I mean, niggas was bringing their older brothers up, 14, 15, and niggas be having bang outs in the school park. You feel what I'm saying? They used to be saying this shit over the loudspeaker, yo. Shots was fired in the school park. I mean, everybody gonna be escorted to the buses, shit like that. School would be um, uh, uh, let out early today, shit like that because of the, the, because of the shootout. It was real like that. So this one particular time, 
It's 89. Like I said, I'm in, I'm in 275 running to this kid. Now, I mean, my son who used to live in my projects in my building in Howard. You feel what I'm saying? He moved out of there years ago. I never knew what happened to the nigga. So I see him like, oh shit, son, what up? He like, son, what up? Now, I mean, so I'm polying with son and shit. You feel me? Now, I mean, son, like, yo, my nigga, now, I mean, I'm in the gang now. You understand what I'm saying? We getting it popping. So at the time, the gang was called YBM, right? Young Black Mafia. So, you know what I mean? Me, 12 years old, being mad, thirsty. I was thirsty to be in any type of gang. I was like, what? Yo, put me down, son. Put me down. So he like, word, I'm going to put you down. I'm going to introduce you to my niggas. You understand what I'm saying? Son lived like, you understand what I'm saying? Like across the street from Van Dyke in them private houses. You feel what I'm saying? So son used to be like, yo, I'm going to put you down. I'm going to introduce you to the team. Niggas is real niggas. Da, da, da. So I'm like, all right. So now I'm amped. Now I'm feeling like I'm in a gang. I'm feeling like I'm tough. You feel what I'm saying? Anybody from Howard, remember, I used to tag YBM up on all of the buildings in the hallways. Niggas used to be getting mad. Yo, the store, no nigga. Little nigga keep fucking tagging up YBM everywhere, man. Stop that shit. You understand what I'm saying? So I was trying to jack my gang at an early age. So this is how I learned the gang shit wasn't for me. You feel what I'm saying? So boom. So like I said, I think I'm in this gang. I think we, I think... Now, I mean, I'm tough. I'm feeling myself. I'm like, yeah, I got a team. Now, I mean, niggas will hold me down if something pop off, whatever. So one day, Easter Sunday, I'm going over there to go check my mans. You feel what I'm saying? I'm stupid fly. I got on a red, white and black Jordan fly, um, flight suit with Jordan on the back. You feel me? And I had them red and white flights with the big tongue. You know which joints I'm talking about, them air flights, the red and white shits to match the suit. So I'm dumb fly jacket. Now, I mean, all this shit swishy. Swishy shit, you feel me? Okay, I'm like, let me, go, let me go to my son crib over there by Van Dyke. I mean, probably like 11, 12 years old, 12, yeah, 12 years old or something, know what I mean? So, I walk over there, me and my man, you feel what I'm saying? We, me and my other man from my projects, you feel what I'm saying? My son, so we go over there. I see, as soon as we get on the block, like as soon as we get all the way down Mother Gaston, you know what I mean? We turn up. I mean, I'm walking, I'm walking under the train station. I mean, I'm heading towards my man spot. I just see a mad group of niggas, like 10 deep Van Dyke niggas, little niggas and all that, little niggas mixed with older niggas. So once I saw them niggas, I already knew it was on. Niggas was staring at my shit, I'm like, and none of these niggas was dressed for Easter. Now that I'm a grown ass man, you feel me? I understand, like, you know what I mean? Nigga can't be running, you can, but it's like you running around mad fly with some niggas, they parents was on drugs, they couldn't afford none of that shit. You feel what I'm saying? I'm running around mad fly. You understand what I'm saying? So I see them niggas, so I hear niggas like, yo, get that nigga, son, get that nigga. So we a block from where my man live at that got the team that I think is my gang. You feel what I'm saying? So these niggas start chasing us. Mad deep, know what I mean? So I ain't have nowhere to run, my nigga. It was too many of them niggas. And back in the days, you know how niggas used to do? Send a little nigga out. This happened a hundred times in my life. Send a little nigga out first. And a little nigga be like, what up, what up? Then if you do something to the little nigga, the big niggas try to jump you. You feel what I'm saying? So little nigga runs up to me. Yo, nigga, take that jacket off. Take that jacket My nerves and reflexes, I just snuffed the nigga. Bong. You understand what I'm saying? He was a little nigga. He dropped. Bong. Nose bleeding. Rest of them niggas start trying to jump me. Bing, bong, bing, bing, bing. They trying to snuff my man. Bing, bong, bing. My man tried to snuff one of them niggas. Bing, bong, bing. You know what I'm saying? But we was outnumbered. It wasn't, it wasn't nothing we could do. It was like 10 of them and two of us. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm running. I'm like, so literally, I'm, these niggas chasing me and they trying to tear my jacket off of me. And I'm holding on to my shit and I'm running. Them niggas trying to tear my jacket. I finally let my jacket go. You understand what I'm saying? And them niggas got the shit. You know what I mean? And I'm like, yo. I'm laughing. I'm like, yo, come, nigga, chase me. Chase me, nigga. Come to my motherfucking, my, my man block, nigga. I got my gang over here. I'm like, I ain't saying all of that, but I'm like, yeah, nigga, come, come, come. So I go, I knock on my man door. I'm like, yo, son, yo, son, niggas is out here trying to jump me, son. Bunch of Van Dyke niggas. Niggas trying to jump me, son. My man was like, yo, son, I can't come outside. I'm, I'm on punishment or some shit like that. Nigga closed the door on my face. It was a hundred niggas out there. I run across the street to the other nigga crib that he fucked with that was supposed to be the head of the gang and shit like that. I knocked on that nigga door. Yo, son, niggas trying to jump me, son. What up? Let's regulate on these niggas. That nigga was like, yo, I ain't got nothing to do with that, son. I room, closed the door. I'm like, oh, man. So now these niggas out there waiting for me. You feel what I'm saying? 
I had to scrap off with them niggas. Them niggas jumping me. You understand what I'm saying? I'm scrapping off trying to get back to my projects. Them niggas chasing me. All they got was my jacket. Them niggas wanted my sneakers, my pants, everything. I was like, the fuck out of here. I was fighting them niggas and running. You understand what I'm saying? But none of them niggas popped off. None of them niggas came out, held me down. None of that, my nigga. And from that day on, I was like, I'm Gucci with the gang shit, nigga. I'm Gucci loafer, Gucci wallet, Gucci gang, everything. You understand what I'm saying? I'm a one-man gang. Fuck it. You understand what I'm saying? I'd rather be outnumbered. You understand? But yeah, niggas ain't do shit. Niggas jumped me. Niggas took my motherfucking um, flight jacket. I'm saying niggas was hating, man. Niggas saw that flight suit. I understand. You see a 12-year-old nigga with that Jordan flight suit on with them flights. Psh, nigga shit shape up looking crazy. Flat top. Know what I mean? I was just looking too fly for them niggas. Like them niggas hate just bursted out like, oh, get them. Know what I mean? Them niggas hate was like, get them. Know what I mean? So I understand, my nigga. They got the jacket, but they ain't get them pants. They ain't get them flights. You feel what I'm saying? It is what it is, nigga. And I was laughing when y'all niggas was chasing me. One of y'all little niggas, I bust this snot box open. You feel what I'm saying? So it is what it is. Know what I mean? Y'all niggas was 10 deep. Y'all jumped me. It is what it is. I ain't even mad at that shit. We was little kids. I look back at that shit. That shit is funny as fuck now. You feel what I'm saying? Niggas close the door on my face. You.